Uh, hello, my name is Nawalko Furo. Um, I'm from Mokashilo, Oahu. My major is aeronautical science, and my role here is I am a senior in the aeronautical science program. Hi, my name is Aislinn Mandalones. Um, I was born and raised right here in Hilo, Hawaii, um, and my major is aeronautical science, senior. Typical day for me looks like uh, I finish work at 6.30 a.m., come to class, class for a few hours, study my textbooks and whatnot for my written exams, um, come by the simulators and do that over again the next day. Okay, um, a typical day for me, I wake up, go to work, and then after work I shoot over here and I come to school, do class for a few hours, and then if I get out early enough, I'll head out, head down to the airport and I'll go out for a flight. So why did, why did I choose UH Hilo? I chose UH Hilo be, uh, because, well first off, it's in-state tuition, um, so that was a, a big thing. But also, um, I didn't want to leave Hawaii. Um, I love everything about these islands that you're up here. Being in Hawaii, I wanted, wanted to be here. So similar to Navaqua, um, I chose to go to UH Hilo just to stay home, um, get the in-state tuition, and support my local university. Why do I think that it's important to study this major? Uh, right now, the aviation industry, there is a huge need for pilots. Um, a lot of pilots are retiring, getting aged out, uh, forced to retire. So we need a lot of young pilots to start fulfilling those roles, filling those holes in the, in the aviation industry. Um, because later on, when you get to your career, you already have the background knowledge and the ground knowledge, um, especially in this field, um, going through the UH program and getting all of your ground training before moving on to actually flying, it just like sets you farther ahead, I, I believe. So uh, what makes this program unique, um, in my opinion, is how the class sizes, um, it being fairly new, um, we are all pretty much tightly knit, um, pretty much like a family in Ohana. Um, we all try to help each other succeed um, and we care about each other, so that, that was, that's what makes this program unique, is that it's very small and we're very close. University, we have uh, seven simulators, three of which um, in here are just uh, X planes, and you can pretty much fly uh, Cessnas. You can even program them to fly like fighter jets, super cool sims. Um, this one here is a 737 panel. Uh, the planes that you fly, like Southwest, all the Southwest planes, this is the panel for that plane. And then in the other room, we have two full motion sims and two single single pilot sims that are FAA approved and you can log hours in every single one. Um, yeah. Okay. In this room, we have four simulators. Uh, these two big sims are full motion simulators and all four of these are approved by the FAA and you can actually log real flight hours in them as long as you're fine with the CFI. I want to be remembered as someone who achieved all of my uh, lifelong goals and no matter how large my aspirations were, as long as I wanted it, I went out and worked for it and got it. For me, I'd like to be remembered as a trailblazer, being part of the, one of the first classes of the aeronautical science program. Um, there was some bumps along the way, but everything got ironed out and we're all good now, so I would just like to be remembered as a trailblazer and working through all these speed bumps. Back when I was 10 years old, I wanted to be a pilot. I didn't know how I'd go about doing it, I didn't know how I would become a pilot, but I knew that that was what I wanted to do. So flashback when I was, um, when I was younger, um, I was in second grade actually, and the Thunderbirds came to our second grade class, uh, some of the pilots, when they were down on a wall, and we got to meet them, and that's kind of, that along with my uncle being a pilot, or uncles being pilots for the Air National Guard, um, that kind of sparked my interest to becoming a pilot, and I'm well on that journey.